Hello, hello, hello. I hope that everybody has had an amazing day. So, I want to talk about these fall days, y'all. It is, like, starting to get a little, little bit nippy out there. You know, just lets me know that winter is on the way. But, anywho, so, guys, um, it's just something that I just needed to share. Um, and it is relating to where are we teaching our young boys? So, if you don't already know, um, I am in the educational field as well as entertainment. Um, but I get to see a lot. I get to hear a lot. Okay. A lot of different experiences cross paths with a lot of different people. And one thing that I am noticing is um, how young boys are relating to different situations. And I would explain because I have had the experience with, um, you know, our uh, young up and coming young men. Okay. And especially when they're young, they are like impressionable um a lot of them are just looking for like certain um figures in their life and they tend to like gravitate towards the ones that are giving like the extra attention so with that being said um i have had the experience of you know a very um young intelligent young man that um, you know, very bright, very bright, but, um, you know, I guess there's some things that are, um, I guess kind of missing in his life. So, um, you know, just looking for, you know, someone to kind of fill that void. And, um, as this young man is getting older, um, you know, I'm starting to notice that he's starting to, like, disconnect from a lot of things that were, like, really meant a lot to him. And um, it kind of alarms me because as being a, a parent and a, a, a Gigi, you know, um, it's just, like, certain things that you want, you know, your kids to feel like um, it's okay to, like, express yourself to have you know um the feelings of affection you know just you know feel the love don't be afraid to give love don't be afraid um to show it don't be afraid to receive it so yeah so it brings me back to like what are we teaching our young boys because this young man is was literally one that would like love to like give hugs get hugs you know that was like what would make this young man's day and now it's like okay well if you're uh, a woman okay you can still get a hug but if you're a guy then it's like mm, nope back up nope psh, let's get that dap whatever the guys do whatever and it's like woo, wow i remember when you know so uh me personally like um I, I look for the hugs, I live for the hugs, and I expect to get hugs from my sons, from my grandsons, um, like, why is it the stereotype that young men cannot be affectionate or, like, give hugs or, like, um, receive hugs, you know, like, why is it that stereotype, you know, that boys have to always be so strong and can't, like, um, show a softer side of them. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. Like, these young boys, they need that extra, like, tender love sometimes, you know, like, everything cannot always be hard, you know, um, like, they're tiny little beings that, you know, they, they, they can, they can use a hug or something, you know what I mean? So, it's like, are we are we really teaching our young boys that it's not okay to like be affectionate or give that 
give that love or receive that hug, whether it's from a male or female, you know, um, like I said, like I have grown children and grandchildren and especially my grown children, like they're like adults and like, I wish they would like try to play that. Oh, you know, I, I can't hug you cause I'm too old. I'd be like, what? Like, did you fall above your head? Like, he was not raised that way, okay? But because my children were not raised that way, they um, look for hugs. Like, it's not it's not a problem with giving another human being a hug, whether it's a male or female, you know? Um, I just don't like when um, the young boys are being taught to be, like, so tough and have their hard exterior that... They can't sow a softer, tender side. So, I said that to say, like, um, be more mindful of how you're teaching the young boys. Because um, it 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 will carry a lot of weight. And it goes a long way when they can show a tender side. Because um, at some point, they will grow up and be an adult. And you might start families of their own. And you want to, um, like, break generational courses and say... Let them know that, okay, you know, it's okay to hug my son. It's okay, you know what I mean? That my son knows that, you know, he's still masculine. But, you know, I don't want to take anything from him by sh shorting him from um, feeling that love, you know? So, yeah, um, that's all I wanted to talk about. It's like, what are we teaching our young boys, you know? Um, they, sh they should be able to feel comfortable in their own skin and feel comfortable to give and receive love whether it's through hugs whatever they should feel comfortable to do that and they should not have that part of um love and affection taken from them hello